First at six, we have another Target 12 investigators exclusive. Three state house staffers have filed a formal complaint against a city lawmaker accusing him of creating a hostile work environment. And they also claim state representative Robert Lancia demanded they conduct campaign research on the taxpayer's dime. Earlier today, we brought the allegations to Representative Lancia, who denied the claims. Target 12 investigator Tim White obtained the written complaint and is here now with the exclusive details. The state house workers filed the complaint two months ago with the JCLS. That's the administrative arm of the General Assembly. In it, the group claims Representative Lancia asked them to do work that made them uncomfortable. Princeton State Representative Robert Lancia has been a lawmaker since he was elected in 2014. In a complaint filed on July 26th and obtained by Target 12 as part of a public records request, three State House employees say Lancia has behaved in a threatening manner on several occasions. The workers, whose names were redacted from the records, say Lancia regularly rants at them and frequently asks staff members to conduct campaign research, including research on his opponent. In a letter to the JCLS with the complaint, a worker says they tried to explain to Rep Lancia that any sort of campaign related work is not permitted within the office. Did you ever ask state house staffers to work on your campaign during normal hours? No, never. Target 12 met up with Lancia on the campaign trail in Cranston. The two term Republican says he may have had a bad day, but denies repeatedly berating staffers or acting inappropriately. Do you think they're making these accusations up against you? No, no, I don't think so. I think there was just a misunderstanding. Because Lancia is not technically a State House employee, a General Assembly lawyer determined the matter had to be handled by House Republican leader Patricia Morgan. She sent this letter to Lancia last month, writing, Your behavior has placed our staff in an uncomfortable and hostile environment. Lancia is being challenged by Democratic candidate Chris Millay this November. You know, it's political season, it's silly season, and, uh, you know, I'm not surprised they got out uh, because, again, I was told it was an internal matter. But, uh, you know, again, my opponent's a state house lawyer working for the speaker. This is a rematch in District 16. Lancia narrowly defeated Malay by just 70 votes two years ago. Malay declined to comment about the allegations against Lancia. With the Target 12 investigators, Tim White, Eyewitness News.